So we are tracking a storm, tornado specifically, and this is the first vlog in forever. Here's 412 turning into the turnpike and then running off towards the north. Meteorologist Jason Adams has new information. Jason? Look at that. has been reported near the Flint Creek area in southern Delaware County. So that's right on the border of Delaware County and also Adair County. So we have a confirmation now of a tornado being reported near Flint Creek. Wants. And that is the south. He was talking about getting ready to move into Benton County. And we now have the report of the Silent Springs. Uh, I can't answer. The oh, there we go. Hello? thunderstorm cell here. Let's go back to our station tracker and see if we've picked up any at all. Not showing a whole lot of shear on it, so if it is a tornado, it's likely a weak tornado that's occurring right now. We'll loop this for us. We can see the center of the rotation moving east. You can see a little bit of green that flickers up every now and then right there towards the, the uh, Oaks area and Kansas area. And if you continue to follow it, you can see the course. Uh, time for this, Dave? <laughs> Dave, we got tornadoes. You want me to worry about sweepers? TJ's all dressed up. Or something. Go, gotta do some news. Oh, baseball stadium? Uh, no. I'm oh. actually uh, covering a benefit tonight. It's gonna be on UATV. Really looking forward to it. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Hopefully. Very nice. You have fun with it. Is this how you're spending your evening, Dakota? Yeah. Very productive. I know. Uh, I guess. You know who's not gonna have a productive evening? Yeah. This guy. Why is that? I want to make a. Is that how they make POV porn? Joke. <laughs> but I think it'd be a little uncouth. I, it would be very uncouth. <laughs> Not completely unrelated to porn. He's going to be pushing a button once an hour for the next three nope, hours. I'm getting that game going to get canceled. They got a tornado warning down there. You know what? Though? I'm feeling frisky. Um, if I can drag myself away from the game for a minute. Because the magic gonna start for like another thirty. Might write an article. Really? About the first about the first round second. I do declare. Well I do. It was very busy up here at King Studios. Right now we got one side over the line. So I'm gonna take this door out there by the that's coming right for us. The dark one is actually a work of art. I like the. Um, There's a tornado warning. Here? Oh, crap. I like the. Um, right now? Yep. I'm not leaving if it's that kind of hail. Supposed to go for that benefit? I'm not hailing right now. No, it's up in Benton County where that thing is. Screw that. I'm not going up there. Was that, did that have anything to do with your corn store? Leftovers. Kind of. All those leftovers from your corn story? Kind of. The fact that you have a story that you call your corn story. <laughs> well, what's kind of this disturbing. corn story? I haven't heard it. What do I really want to hear? So. I haven't eaten corn all week, right? I had corn for lunch. This is leftovers. Do you, do you usually eat corn every day? No. Uh, it's like I've, a regular part of your diet? I've been working it in because if you combine corn with the right, um, with the right other vegetable combination, it forms into a perfect protein. That's cool. So if you combine beans and wheat, corn and beans, peanuts and corn, uh, it forms into a protein. It's just a really quick way to get corn. So I hadn't eaten corn all week. I had some corn for lunch. Took a quick poo. Corn in the poop. <laughs> That's your whole corn store? Yeah. Corn doesn't die, man. You I know. You cannot Neither destroy blueberries. corn. Yeah, blueberries stay in there too. But the thing is, is like I had just eaten it. Like I'm talking about 20 minutes of, 20 minutes of pastime. I thought it took 30 to get down your esophagus. Oh, like, it took like sometimes like hours. Yeah, a to day. get all the way no, through the whole system. No, this took 20 minutes from here to there, gone. Maybe you have a super colon. Or maybe corn, you just don't know about corn it. Corn just like it. Corn knows. Corn is a super protein. It knows so the secret Lemmy Wings passage down my colon. I don't you do look like you do look like um, if 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 you were drawn as a South Park character. 
Yeah. I think they used the same head that they used for Mr. Slave. They just wouldn't have, they just wouldn't have a mustache. Or the gay police hat. <laughs> My sister said, when I was like, I was like 10, I was a fat little kid, and I used to wear an Eric Cartman shirt. She's like, you look just like that dude. Wow. Did you yeah. wear a little toboggan? No, I didn't wear beanies back then. I wear beanies now. And now you, you look like either the trainer from Rocky or a, a shipyard worker. I don't look like Mick. Yeah, you kind of do. Like if you were older and you he's had like a like ear need. He's got like a prune face and his ear lobes are down to here. Yeah. I can do that with big ears. That's a fact. That's true. You got you kind of hunched over a little bit sometimes? Not usually, but sometimes you're a little hunched over. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you'll when you're when you're thinking about something, your posture goes to the shit. It happens with everybody. I didn't do that earlier. Like when I'm looking at that computer, my posture just completely. Yeah. Duh. First of all, you don't make those sounds. And if I did, you wouldn't know. Yeah. Somebody was trying to read an email line earlier, and it took them forever. Forever. Like they were, they were reading. Sandbox reference, or Sandlot reference. Forever. Yeah, but seriously, like. I thought he had finished reading it, but then he started reading a sentence that was like in the middle. He was like the first half. To the middle of the first half. So he was like 25% through the email. Dude, you gotta take in those chapters. I just, I have to read so fast. If you can't read fast in, in college, like you just, you're gonna spend nine hours doing your homework every single day. I don't read fast. Do you just bullshit your way through essays? And I told you I was the last one out. Every single test, I was last. It was a daily, it was a uh, monthly, whatever routine. I go in there, take my test. I'd be the last one out. Ask the teacher if she wanted any help picking up her papers, taking her to her office. She said no. I'm like, all right, see you later. I never had a. Oh, I had some hot Spanish teachers. Oh, I always got the old ladies. 